This is not a Dalit versus non-Dalit confrontation. In one sentence, HRD Minister Smriti Irani dismissing what has been the only foundation of the opposition's attack. Why I am compelled to come out today and state these facts out in the open? There has been a malicious attempt to ignite passions and present this as a caste battle. It is not. At least the twelve Dalit students who was who are, I mean, reported to have committed suicide in the university. But what is happening here? The MHRD minister has been engineering. Through her talk, that this issue is between Congress versus BJP. This is about Rohit Vemula. This is about these five students of University of Hyderabad. But Smriti Rani says that this is standard procedure, and the same action was taken for another letter that was written not by a member of the BJP, but by a member of Parliament of the Congress, Hanuman Rao, which also spoke of several anomalies that were taking place on campus at the Hyderabad University. Congress MP Hanuman Rao wrote to me about. Suicide of Dalit students in this very university in the past four years, even when the government of the day was not in centre. Why was this issue not taken up then? Why now? Why nobody in the Congress party spoke about it then and not now? Suti Irani, she is saying that Hanuman Thera also wrote a letter, but my letter is entirely different with Datta Thera. Involvement of the Vice Chancellor, misappropriation, and also seven students was died. All those things you rectify. I wrote a letter. What can't be denied, though, is that the students were suspended from college in the last week of December. I'm not too sure whether the suspension has really uh, been the cause for the suicide. Post suspension, they were camping in a tent outside the hostel and protesting their suspension. It is never too late for fighting for justice. If you want to give justice to Rohit, you also have to read his letter on 18 December 2015. That in the university, ABVP activists are making derogatory remarks against the students from SC community. The last 48 hours has seen a steady stream of politicians from the university campus, all of them wanting to make themselves heard and making themselves count, but in trying to ensure that they make a political point with their constituency and ensure that the blame is fixed on the center, have they forgotten that a young life has been lost in the bargain and that to ensure that this does not happen again should be priority. This video journalist Rajesh Bharadwaj in Hyderabad, Padma Joshi, for Times Now.